Many couples, when trying to have a baby, want to know what they can do to increase their chances of success while trying to conceive, and there are a few basic principles about fertility that should help you along in the process. The best thing to do if you're trying to have a baby is to track your cycles. And most women have a cycle that's 25 to 35 days in length, and if that's the case with you, chances are you're ovulating midway through your cycle or about 12 to 16 days before your next period is going to start. And it's all about timing intercourse with ovulation. Ovulation is when your, a woman's body releases an egg that can then be fertilized by sperm if things are timed just right. And if that happens, then you get pregnant. Um, and you're most fertile for six days out of each month five days leading up to ovulation and on the day of ovulation. And the reason why there's that five day window beforehand is because sperm can live inside a woman's reproductive tract for three to five days. So six days out of each month, there's a possibility that you could get pregnant. If you don't wanna think about it all, just start having intercourse on the day your period ends and continue with this every other day um, for about seven to 14 days, depending on how long your cycles are. So like the longer your cycle, the longer you should continue with this. The shorter your cycle, probably the sooner you can stop. So like seven to, to 12 days might be long enough, but this should help things to be timed just right. That time between ovulation and, and when your next period is going to start is very nerve wracking. But unfortunately, there's no way to know if you actually got pregnant until you miss a period. And if that day comes where your period never starts, take a home pregnancy test and if it's positive, congratulations. But if it's negative, it might just be because you took it a little bit too soon. So wait another week or so. And if your period still hasn't started, then take another test and hopefully at that point, it's positive for you. If it's still negative or you have regular cycles or if you've been trying for more than a year to conceive, talk with your doctor and they can determine if treatments are warranted that will help you in your dreams to have a baby. Good luck with everything and if you have any other questions for me in the future, feel free to ask them on our Facebook page at facebook.com forward slash intermountain moms and recommend us to your friends and family too.